Okay, I'm making a video here to show how to put the voltage sensors on your screen. I have a receiver here in my quad, so I'm going to go ahead and just plug this little guy right here, which is a voltage sensor, into the top part of it. And then the other end is plugged into the balance plug, red to red and black to black. Okay, that's all you got to do on your airplane or your quad. Now we're going to go over to the transmitter. You tap on the main screen. Choose sensors. There are none. So I choose one. Sensor one. I like to put my receiver, uh, I'm sorry, the transmitter on first. So I put that on. Transmitter voltage are the sort of choices here. And then over here, you'll see the little red uh, uh, empty set. Click on that. That turns on your alarms. You put the low alarm. And we're going to lower that to 380. Come back. We have sensor number two. External voltage. Turn that on. I'm going to set the low alarm. Be three cell battery, so I like to put it right in at around 380, uh, 1080, I'm sorry, for the voltage. Set that up. And then the receiver. Turn that on. Low alarm. 390. And there you have it. You've got your transmitter voltage, 392 or 91. External voltage, 1150. Internal voltage of uh, 493. Now, let's say that the... Uh, Voltage goes away on your battery. You'll notice when you tap on your screen so you can see it during the day. External voltage is not showing properly here. So, we'll go back here and put that back in. And it puts the alarm back in the normal place and everybody's happy. And that's it. That's all you got to do. Once again, with these sensors, be careful how you handle them here. I had one of these burn up by just moving it. So what I do is I wrap it, super glue it here, so that way when it gets tugged, it gets tugged on the super glue, not the end going into the circuit board, because they're uh, soldered very closely. This is Jack. Thanks.